it is time now to meet my guest today. Just over a year ago, Street Dance Crew Diversity auditioned for a show called Britain's Got Talent. Have you heard of it? Yeah? Mm. Small show. <laughs> they backflipped their way to the final, beating the mighty Subo, and things have gone from strength to strength. Now, as well as performing all over the country, their leader went on to become one of the judges on Sky One's hit show, Got To Dance, where he's still got a chance to show off his skills. Bonker. <laughs> Oh, please welcome Ashley Banjo! Hello! Come and sit yourself down. Oh, of course you can have a hug. Oh, welcome to the show. I'm so excited to have you on. Now, what a massive year for you. you everything has happened. It's just been crazy, crazy, crazy year. I mean, I was watching some of BGT the other week and I, I was looking at the auditionees thinking like I was one of those a year ago. Just a year ago? It does feel like you've been around for such a long time though, I've yeah. got to say. In, in the nicest in the possible nicest way. way. <laughs> so you watch it, you're watching it now. Have you got yeah. any favourites of, uh, of Britain's Got Talent? Um, oh, who was I, I was loving Tobias on the first week. He's the one with the cap, isn't yeah, he? Back, who does mask. the backwards yeah, thing. Yeah, he was really good. And I was loving um, the gymnastics group, Spellbound, I think. <gasps> yeah. They were, yeah, wicked. They, were good. they were unbelievable. Is yeah. the part of you that kind of, because uh, hopefully there's going to be another uh, Got to Dance, isn't there? Yeah. Is there not part of you that's thinking, Tobias, why have you gone in for that competition? Come in for Come ours. Come for our one, yeah, exactly. But no, it's, it's, it's all good, spreading it around, you know. All right, then. Uh, so do you think, with all the um, uh, dance groups like Tobias that's in mm -hmm. Brits Got Talent, do you think there's a chance that another dance act can win? Because obviously there's been yourselves, George Sampson. Do you think it can happen again? Um, I think it's got every chance of happening again. I yeah. mean, dance is just getting bigger and bigger in this country. How come? So. How, how come? Especially with, with street dance, how, mm. how come it's become so mainstream? Do you think it's down to diversity? I think we've helped. <laughs> 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 but no, I don't think it's down to diversity. I just think that, you know, I think the public were just waiting for it to happen. You know, yeah. it's, it's been there. And it's been growing like behind the scenes, and now it's now it's kind of exploded on TV, and it's just, it's just going from strength to strength. I think you should take responsibility for it. I think okay, you should I just say it's all down to me. <laughs> it's all down to yeah. me. I take full responsibility. Now it was only a year ago that you were you were in the competition. Yeah. Sky Ones got to dance. You were the judge. Was that not quite hard going from being the contestant and the judged to yeah. the judge within four months? Yeah, five. Yeah, it was. That was. That was one of the weirdest things I've done. Definitely, because obviously sitting behind, you know, behind the desk, being a part of the like production team, not being a contestant in the show, seeing yeah. seeing it from a completely different perspective was was really odd. Was it really hard to say no to some of the contestants? Yeah, very hard. I, I, I changed my <laughs> mind like every other go. I mean, uh, and Kimberly got used to get a little bit angry as well, didn't she? She did. She's very. Um, okay. Strong. Yeah, she's a strong minded, strong -minded female. Strong minded female. But a good judge, though, I think, because yeah. was, she was never a catty or anything like that. No. You knew that she was so experienced, and I, I definitely respected what all three of you, as judges, there was Adam Garcia as well, as, as yeah. what all of you were saying to the contestants. Yeah. Do you think that the best man won? It was Akai, of course. Akai? <laughs> Akai? Oh, Akai. You know, I love Akai. Honestly, he's so talented, and he's one of those dancers that you can't. It doesn't hit you how good he is until you see him in real life. And yeah. he's so small, and he does things he does things that men can't do. I mean, he opened for us on our opening oh, night of our tour. Oh, there he is. Look there him. he is. And he's honestly, I, I so he brilliant. he opened up for you on the first night of your tour. First night of our tour, he was our opening act. Yeah. And oh he, my he goodness down, me! Went down brilliantly. And is he all right? Is he is he taking all the new f newfound fame in his stride? He's loving it. Cap back, <laughs> bowling around. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love it. Yeah. Um, now, you're doing some other kind of judging as well at the moment, aren't you? I am. I'm a judge for Just Dance, the Nintendo Wii game. And um, we're holding auditions at the end of May to look for someone to be a character in the new game. How cool is that? It's brilliant. Now, we, we uh, featured the uh, uh, the game on the show once and, you know, I had a little go on it. Okay. So there's the outline, isn't there, yeah. of, the, of, the, uh, of the dancer and you have to follow so all those follow moves. It, yeah. And someone's actually got the chance to be the person that you to follow. To be the person that you follow. So, uh, now, can it just be a normal person, like... 
I don't know, say me. <laughs> or, or, <laughs> or are we just going to get like the whole of pineapple dance studios like coming and, and applying? Is it just for pros? I hope not. I mean, you have to be 16, but right. apart from that, it can, can be anybody. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I'm, ju I'm just a little bit over shade, 16. Shade. Now no. you said you said you've got you've got your tour and Akai opened yep. it, so that went nationwide, didn't it? Nationwide, 30 dates. Did you uh, choreograph the whole show? Yeah. Top. By yourself? Yeah. How tough is that? Because obviously you, you do like the little five minute diversity ones, yeah. but from going from that to how long was the show? An uh, hour and 45 minutes. Uh, uh, um, yeah. How old are you? 21. It just oh absolutely blows my mind how old you are, but how talented you are. Anyway, oh, thank you. just ask you the question. So, so how do you go from doing something for five minutes to, to, to an hour and 40 minutes of choreography? Do you know what? I, I, I would love to ask myself. I'd love to kind of come and ask how, how because I... I'm used to choreographing, you know, five minute routines, ten minute routines, but when I sat there and was like, right, we've got the task to choreograph a whole show, <clears throat> and it's completely different. You have to think about, like, I wrote a narrative, I wrote a storyline, and, like, it, there's just so much more to think about. Actually, you know how writers get a kind of block thing? Do you get that when you're choreographing? Sometimes, yeah. I mean, sometimes I could stand there, and all of a sudden, like, coming here in the car, I was like, oh, I had my headphones on, I had an idea, wrote it down. Sometimes I could be standing there in front of a mirror and it's just block. Nothing. Nothing. Just oh. depends how you feel. Haven't you got a question, Zoe? Oh, gosh, I've <laughs> loads. I've loads. I've loads. <laughs> you must have a favourite routine. I mean, I actually was there, we were there at the final of, um, of, oh. of um, Got to Dance, okay, um, right, the routine yeah. that we just saw there in the VT. But uh, what's your most favourite piece of music and your favourite <laughs> routine? There must be one. Do you know what? As you can tell by our routines, the music's so varied. We go mm. from classical to yeah. hip hop to it's all like I don't have one fav one favourite piece. You edit it all together as well, the music, don't you? Yeah. Honestly, Ashley, you just you, you just un unbelievably talented. Oh guys, thank you. Honestly. You are actually, and also we were wondering because we also know that before BGT came along, you yeah. were actually at university, yeah. and uh, we all know you deferred your degree. Is yeah. you know, are you thinking about going back to? Yeah, it, it, as soon as I get the chance to finish. I don't know if you'll ever get the chance. I know. Mm, you're going to be sure choreographing and dancing it's, forever. I can't win, see win, you getting a break. If, yeah. if, if, I, if, I get a, if I get time to finish it, then it's all good. I've only got one year left. Right. And I worked so hard. Like It wasn't an easy degree, and I yeah. kind of worked hard to keep dancing going as well. So if I get the chance to finish it, then all good. Full respect to you. You yeah. are an amazing role model. Oh, thank you. Amazing Honestly, role model.